just doing the next video for the electronics learning lab from Radio Shack. Let me go in closer to the circuit here. This is a circuit that is a fully adjustable siren. So it uses this 555 chip. It uses the uh, 4046 chip. Let's see, we got a bunch of 9 volt power source over here. We have a well, we have a 10 microfarad electrolytic capacitor, and we have a 1 microfarad electrolytic capacitor. What else do we have? Okay, so we have, here we have a 0 0.001 microfarad ceramic capacitor, um, which, by the way, the book says is the second capacitor, but it labeled it C. It labeled it C2, but it should be C3 because we already have one and two capacitors here. So that's the third capacitor. Anyways, um, we have some resistors here. We have a, try to get in there, geez, um, brown, black, green, which is a 1 million, and a yellow, violet, yellow, which is 470K. <clears throat> What are some other things we have? We have the, <coughs> excuse me, transformer connected. We have the speaker connected. And we have a couple potentiometers over here, all connected. Um, the, this one controls the pitch of the siren. This one controls the number of cycles per second. And this one controls the balance of the up-down tone. Okay, so lots of things going on here. Um, but let me try to uh, get a bird's eye view again so you can see everything. Okay, so I'm going to turn the um, unit on. And this will the speaker over here will emit a siren-like sound. And then I'll just simply adjust, adjust these... Um, potentiometer so you can um, hear the sound effects. Okay, so here we go. Okay, <clears throat> so there you go. This is a fully adjustable siren, it says. Again, the main things uses 555 chip and a 4046 chip. 
So thanks for checking this out. I'll see you next video. Bye-bye.